We're on our way to the ski shop to pick up our rentals for Jenny's first day of skiing ever. And I'm only slightly terrified. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm actually getting really excited to try. I'm really excited for the magic carpet. And my goal for the day is to make it down the blue run without falling at all. How are your boots feeling? They feel so weird. I can't like straighten my legs. <laughs> like they're always bent. Jacob said that's normal, but it feels really weird. I feel so legit right now. Like, wait, I think I do it like this, like this. There you go. Do I look so cool? <laughs> <laughs> and now we go walk over the magic carpet. I'm gonna look way cooler right now than I will all day long. Cause I'm about to fall on my butt a lot. Jacob's a homie. He's carrying my skis for me. I have to. Nice. I have to keep her in a positive mood all day. <laughs> I'm getting less scared, I think, but maybe still really scared. Okay, Jenny, which way is the which way is the hill slanting? Okay, so that's why we put our skis like this. So you're gonna put on your downhill ski first. Heel's important. Toe first. And now you're gonna push down really hard with your heels. <laughs> nice job. Yeah, I did it. I did it. Okay. okay nice okay. job. That was awesome. Now I'm nervous for the second one. All right. Nice job. I'm on skis. I'm on skis. You're gonna be so good. <laughs> I'm nervous now. It's the real part. How you feeling? Good. I feel good. Good. Dang! Look at you. Stuck the landing. Well, this feels weird. I've never been on a carpet before. Really? Yeah. It feels fun. You want to go to the top on your first one ever? I told you I'm not going to fall. Okay. Nice job. Remember to pizza. Slide to one side, so put pressure on one leg. Probably your right leg, right leg. Damn, I nice told you. job! I told you I could go down it without falling my first time. <laughs> nice job. But I did it! That was impressive. Let's go again. Okay. Woo, I wasn't recording any of that, but she did great. Okay, how do you feel? Second time down. I felt like I did a lot better because I felt like I was more in control. And I still haven't fallen! That turn, there you go. Make it more exaggerated. There you go. Nice job. Nice job. Keep it going, keep it going. Woohoo! Jenny has already sent me away to do a little bit harder of a run. She's gonna do the magic carpet all by herself and we'll see how she's feeling when I come down. Made it onto the chair lift. Let's see if we can find Jenny. Yeah, Jenny! She's so far away now. It's her first time skiing alone. She's doing a great job. I'm so proud of her. I lost her in the clouds, but I think she did a great job. I don't think she fell down. So she's gonna do it a couple more times and we'll see you at the bottom. <laughs> Honestly, it was so nervous. And now that I've gone down that little hill a few times, I am just like, I have the need for speed and I just wanna like go up this big one right now. That's probably taking it a little bit too far. There is low visibility out here today. So this is the normal run. It's pretty easy. Maybe not for Jenny, but we can find stuff in here. This might be a little bit dangerous. There's a little cavern here. Ooh, I had to jump over that. I like skiing down here by the chairlift because it's usually a little bit more difficult. And it's a little bit more steep over here too. The snow is pretty decent, actually. It's not supposed to be like one of the best places to ski ever, 
but and they haven't got a lot of snow this year but it's pretty good there's jacob he's that little dot right there oh he's going to the side wow he did a little jump <laughs> that's awesome you did it ah! oh i did not like that <laughs> you did a little jump yeah that was fun. Going again. Jenny thinks that hers is too easy. So we're gonna have to go over and do a harder one. We're gonna have to go take the bus over to the easy hill because Jenny is getting a little bit bored of the magic carpet. I'm gonna go down this intermediate run one more time and then we'll get on the bus. Let's see how many trees we can go through. Oh yeah, fresh snow! We are moving on to something more difficult. Woohoo, I'm so excited. I feel like that one, I was just like, all right, I'm over it. Let's go bigger. So you're confident now? I am, but I feel like I'll be scared when I see the bigger hill, for sure. What was the most challenging thing and what was something that was easy? I was way easier than I thought to not fall. Like, I know I'm saying that like on the little baby hill, but like I literally thought I was gonna put on my skis and instantly like do a backflip and like fall over. Oh, our bus is here, we gotta go. <laughs> and then what was challenging? Stopping was so hard. I feel like that's gonna be scary when I'm going fast because I feel scared to like, I feel like I'm just gonna topple over. We made it to South Point. Jenny is going to try to do the beginner runs now. I'm so excited to see how she does. Let's go. I put on my mask because we bought them. So I felt like I needed to use it. <laughs> Scan it. Put it up there. There we go, it's oh. green. Wow, that works well. Okay, gotta wait for the chair to pass. Now it's green, now don't move because it's gonna take you. And then you're gonna sit down right there. Chair lifts, for sure the scariest part so far. I thought <laughs> I was gonna fly off. Because earlier today when I was waiting for Jacob to come down the mountain, I actually saw a girl fly off of one. <laughs> Maybe that's why my chair stopped that one time. Jenny says looking down is trippy. Also, I feel like my feet are just gonna fall off my body. They're so heavy with the skis. Oh, so you should put your skis on, <laughs> on the footrest. Oh, that's so much better. <laughs> I felt like I was like being dragged off the ski lift. Yeah, but when you don't put the bar down and your feet are just dangling there, it definitely feels like they're gonna yeah, fall off. Yeah, that felt weird. Wow, I'm excited. This is a long one. I'm excited for it. My fingers feel like they're going to fall off. It is so foggy we can like barely see in front of us. Okay, Jenny's first real run ever. How are we going to do? I don't know. It's really long. It took us what, like 10 minutes to get up here, Jacob? Yeah, about that. So long, so long. Jacob, I'm scared. So don't run into any people. <laughs> so you're gonna have to go or move to the side. Exact same thing, just exaggerate the turns more. Keep it up, you're doing great. There you go. 
Jenny's back up. We're ready to go. It is foggy. You can hardly see anything. Like I would be totally fine, but like I literally cannot see five feet in front of me. So I'm going to go first and Jenny's just going to follow my lead. All right. First stop, we're just gonna stop right in front of those people. Just look at me. So we're gonna go all the way over. And then we're gonna plant the pole. Oh no, you gotta follow me. I'm gonna go, count to four, and then follow me. And we're gonna stop right there. You gotta follow me, follow my tracks. You're doing great. Oh yeah! There you go, keep making those turns. There you go. Nice job. What's that? My butt is on fire. <laughs> oh my gosh. I need to take out my hot hands. No. Your hands are too cold? Yeah. How was it? It was fine, scary. <laughs> I wish I could see what was in front of me, but that's the scariest part. We still have a lot more of this run to go. We're gonna work on our form now. Yeah! There she is! You're doing so great. I'm proud of you. Thanks, honey. I like that we can see now. It was really scary up there. All right, see ya. Bye! Go fast, go fast, go fast, go fast! Or else you'll be walking. When I am saying we can't see, like I literally would be here and Jacob would be five feet away from me and I could barely see him. Like it is so foggy and for somebody who's, this is the first time I'm skiing, like it's really scary not knowing what's five feet in front of me. Like that has been the hardest thing. Time to go again. I literally thought when we were at the top of that and I couldn't see and I had just fallen and I was freaking out. I was like, there is no way I'm doing that again. We're making it down for the second time. We haven't stopped or fallen once. There we go, keep going. We need some speed. We need some speed going in. There you go, keep it up. entire mountain without falling what and we went super fast at some points the only problem was is that i wasn't wearing my goggles so like my eyes were getting pelted with snow the whole time but it was so much better the second time around than the first time so we're gonna go even faster the third time <laughs> don't know about that <laughs> we went down the chair instead of off to the side there was a little jump that people created but she didn't survive it. It was very bumpy. <laughs> but I did slide down the mountain on my skis, just with my hands behind me too. We just got inside this little restaurant. We are going to rest here for a little bit. Let's interview Jenny and see her thoughts on the experience so far. Just de-icing my hair. <laughs> oh man, that's a lot of ice in there. How many times did we do the beginner run? Four? Nice. Yeah. How many times did you make it down without falling a single time? Three. Really? Yeah. What about the last one? Oh yeah, but that doesn't count because we went on like this, like it wasn't like the main run. It was like a little side trail. And the only reason I fell was because at the very end of it, it like went up. It was like a big jump and I couldn't do that. Okay, another question. Did you hear me screaming, go slower? There's a big jump at the end? Yes. <laughs> but you... I thought I was going slow. <laughs> Yeah, and then you picked up speed and you went on the jump. The biggest challenge so far has definitely been the fog. Like, that is what is nerve-wracking when I can't see anything. Jenny, I just want you to know that I'm so proud of you. Uh, 
<laughs> Thank you, baby. You are doing a great job. So good for a beginner. How long is this, Jacob? Like It's 2,200 meters. So I don't know, like, I don't know what normal runs are, but like, it's a pretty long one it for a beginner. It takes a while, yeah. We are getting the bus back to the bigger hill. We still haven't decided if Jenny is going to try to get on that or if it's just gonna be me. I'm all alone. Jenny did not want to come do the intermediate stuff, which I completely understand. Extremely proud of her. I thought she was going to be crying the whole day, but she only cried once. So I'd say that's a huge win. It looks like there's a few jumps over here. That's probably what I'm going to be doing. I would just like to say that I will definitely be going skiing again. I am so happy that we got this opportunity, even though it was a little bit outside of my comfort zone. We might go cross country skiing, so stay tuned for that. And I hope you guys enjoyed the videos of Jacob going down the big mountains. We will see you guys next video.